when someone drinks a poison things like strychnine or some pesticide ends up drinking immediately you make them eat charcoal or make powder and make them drink the charcoal powder you can save a life farming agriculture traditional way as well as the newest latest technology in the field of agriculture really excites me it's very innovative and can save a lot of efforts by going into research in the field of agriculture for example <clears throat> we can produce with little effort much more produce for example when we use bio charcoal it doubles up or triples up our yield and what is the cost of bio charcoal no more than 4000 rupees per ton if you can have the paddy production doubled up tripled up imagine the profit you are talking about and this bio charcoal we just have to put only once because bio charcoal doesn't degrade at all for thousands of years it just stays there it keeps things absorbed in its intracellular structure it doesn't collapse in fact as it collapses more surface area only increases what happens when particle is broken down the total surface area will only increase so more it breaks down the larger the surface area and the greater the capacity to absorb nutrients into its structure we have all seen how most ro filters they use charcoal also to purify water what is the quality of this charcoal it absorbs everything good and bad when someone drinks a poison things like strychnine or some pesticide ends up drinking immediately you make them eat charcoal or make powder and make them drink the charcoal powder it will keep it absorbed in the stomach it will not go from stomach into blood and you can save a person you can save a life another you know the monkey brand it cleans your teeth very well charcoal see another use you are traveling a lot you are in a village to village on the way you might have diarrhea what will happen take a roti or chapati or a bread burn it a little bit make a charcoal out of it and eat it that will remove diarrhea because it absorbs all the toxins so let's make use of new innovations here we are trying new stuff we are also trying tissue culture we are trying hydroponics we are trying this direct root irrigation for injection we are also trying our way with this uh, aeroponics hydroponics aquaponics so so many things are going on in our ashram but most importantly <clears throat> it is the atmosphere that we provide helps the plants to grow better